Hey there gang, Patrick King here coming to you live from Casanova, New York, teaching today over the next couple days uh, here at Canterbury Stables here in Casanova. <clears throat> today I want to talk to you a little bit about what I see as the four biggest lies in horsemanship. And no, I'm not talking about lies like kids safe, bomb proof, you know, always sound. Those, uh, I won't even count those. What I'm talking about are the lies that you've probably never said, but you've probably heard your friends say about maybe their horses out on a ride or while they're, while they're working with those horses. Those four lies are all of a sudden, out of nowhere, for no reason, and without warning, okay? Now, we say this kind of joking, but you've heard people say these and you may even be guilty of saying those yourself, right? I'm out on a ride and you know, I'm walking my horse and all of a sudden he bolts, right? Or we're cantering along and for no reason at all, he bucks. Uh, without warning, he just takes off, you know? Uh, all of a sudden, out of nowhere, he kicks at the horse next to him. That sort of thing. I think of those as our four biggest lies in horsemanship. Again, all of a sudden, out of nowhere, for no reason, and without warning. Basically, those things don't make any sense, right? Uh, let's take, for example, we're walking along the trail and all of a sudden he bolts, right? Well, it can happen that fast, right? But there's changes that have to take place in the horse's body and in the horse's mind in order for that bolt to take place. His weight might have to shift, his body might have to change in balance, things like that. Now, it can be so fast you might not be able to catch it before it takes place, but those things just don't happen all of a sudden, out of nowhere, for no reason, without warning, right? Uh, one of my favorites is, you know, for no reason he spooked. Really? For no reason at all, he just started bucking. Well, come on, that doesn't make any sense, right? For no reason at all, my friend just got upset, right? No, you would never say anything like that. You know, it's interesting, we never hear those four lies told about positive things. All of a sudden, my horse just gave me a 30-foot sliding stop. Out of nowhere, we just started doing tempe changes across the arena, right? For no reason, we just got a beautiful canter pirouette. You know, those things don't make any sense. Without warning, you know, the perfect lead departure happened. We never say those things because we realize it takes a lot of hard work for those great things to happen, right? It takes a lot of preparation in our body and in our horse's body for all the positive things that we want to shape up like they do. The same thing happens with the negative stuff, right? Maybe we just aren't paying close enough attention to how things are shaping up to the horse's mental state, to the horse's physical state, all right? So I want you to think about that next time you catch yourself or your friends telling one of those four lies. Remember, that's all of a sudden, out of nowhere, for no reason, or without warning, all right? Those things don't make any more sense for the negative things than they would for the positive things that we would ask for from our horses. I hope this is helpful. Thanks so much, guys.